developing right now at Ford. The investigation into what exactly led up to a 22-year-old man being shot and killed in Henderson does continue. Right now, we know at least two suspects are in custody nearly 200 miles away in Arizona. 8 News Now's David Charnes has more on what witnesses say happened. Henderson police say they got several calls of people being shot at early Thanksgiving morning. It ended here at this 7-Eleven parking lot where a 22-year-old man died. Then those suspects were on the run. Not even 30 seconds later, I heard maybe three more gunshots. Um, and then right after that, a, another sequence, probably two or three after that. And I'd say there was probably a total of maybe 12 or 13. Neighbors like Melissa Wells say they heard the shots and knew something was wrong. In addition to the young victim, four other people were hit in these random shootings. At least one bullet hitting the outside of that 7-Eleven, shattering this window. Police say at least two people were seen in the car that got away. A man and a woman with tattoos or paint on their faces. Later Thanksgiving Day, more shootings more than 100 miles away from Henderson in La Paz County, Arizona. Sources there tell 8 News Now they believe the pair is connected to shootings in the small towns of Booz and Parker. It ended with a shootout with police, those suspects taken into custody. Now, because police tell us there were several shootings before this young man was killed in this parking lot and there were reports of gunshots around town, they do want to hear from any witnesses. You can call police directly or you can report anything anonymously to Crime Stoppers. We're at Lake Mead in Sunset in Henderson. I'm David Charns, 8 News Now.